Boy! Look, if you haven't jumped on the electric vehicle bandwagon, it's got a 400 mile charge and it's leaving the charging station without you. Nah, I'm just kidding. A lot of EVs won't even hit the market for a few years. But Ford is making a statement for electric vehicles everywhere with their announcement of the F-150 Lightning. The Ford F-Series truck tops the charts for the best selling vehicle, not just truck, vehicle, in the US. Now it's interesting that they're counting the F-150, the F-250, and the F-350 all in that same vehicle. But nevertheless, the F-150 has made its way into our garages and our hearts over the last 45 years. And Ford is trying to secure its place in the EV future with their best selling vehicle. This hasn't been done yet, folks. This is a big deal. And why should you care? Because electric vehicles will change the game and the economy. If electric vehicles want any chance of succeeding, we're gonna have to build a network of charging stations across wherever people are commuting. Ideally, they're gonna have to be as accessible as gas stations are. They're gonna have to allow for fast, efficient, and affordable charging. And probably most important out of all of those features is the ability to smash the like button on the charging station for the YouTube algorithm. But this video isn't about the broader EV world, this is about the F-150 Lightning. The base price will start at $40,000, which ain't bad, right? I mean, your normal raggedy old gas-powered F-150 is probably gonna set you back 50 Gs, so 40,000 ain't too bad. But you're not gonna want the base model. We're not even talking like bells and whistles, we're talking like bare bones, doing as little as you can to get it to the point where you can call it a truck. It's even coming with what they're calling their standard range battery, uh, which is 230 miles at a full charge. So a little below average. You're gonna want the XLT or above package, which starts at $55,000 and has a range of about 300 miles, which right now in the EV world is about middle of the road. But check this out. That 300 mile range is the EPA estimated rating with a thousand pounds of cargo in the trunk. So this truck at our studio with no weight in the trunk was quoting me 367 miles. And from the indicator on the dashboard, the battery was about 80-ish percent full, which if, if I'm doing my math right, that extrapolates out to about 460 miles at 100%, which right off the bat is a lot less concerning than 300 would have been. So that's promising. To be able to go 400 plus miles with an electric truck is awesome, especially right out of the gate for Ford. Yeah, they've got the Mach-E and some other stuff in the works, but for an F-150, that's impressive. All right, this next section is called list off as many features as I can in 10 seconds. And Mark, get set, go. Zero to 60 in less than five seconds. 11 power outlets, a freaking front. You can use your phone as the key. 15 and a half inch touchscreen, 10,000 pounds of towing capacity, 2,000 pounds of payload, and it can power your house for three days. Ah, dang it. But seriously, powering your entire house for three days from your truck? Mm. Sign me up. So, all in all, this is a solid entrance into the EV world for the F-150. You can make a reservation online now, officially order it in the fall, and then it will probably be delivered spring 2022. The link to the reservation website is in the description. For every F-150 that you order, Ford will send me a free F-150. Maybe? Maybe? Ford? Huh? Just kidding. I don't get anything. But... For your convenience sake, the link is in the description if you're like, heck yeah, I gotta get me one of these. All right guys, thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed yet, please hit the subscribe button. Uh, this is a brand new channel, trying to grow it as much as possible. Um, so that would be a big help. Hope you have a great rest of your day and I will see you next time.